Good morning, children. Praise the Lord. We meet again today. Stay happy and healthy in this new day. Before we start our activities, let us start the day with a meditation with God's Word this morning. Taken from Jesus is the Best and Faithful Friend book, Written by Pastor Maralap Segala. Our topic for today is Hallowed Be Thy Name in Jesus' Prayer. Before we proceed, shall we start with a prayer? Thank you, Lord, for the new day. Now we are ready to listen to your word. May your Holy Spirit be within us. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Our memory verse for today is from Luke chapter 11, verse 2. It says, He said to them, When you pray, say, Father, hallowed be your name, your kingdom come. Praying means communicating with God. We speak and God hears. Praying is also that we are coming to meet God. We come and God welcomes. When we come and meet God through prayer, we call God Father, which is our Father in heaven. It means that we put ourselves as a child and God is the Father. In other words, we are declaring that we have a relationship with God. Since God is the Father, therefore we should give honor to Him by saying, Hallowed be your name. To hallow the name of the Lord requires that the word in which we speak of the Supreme Being be uttered with reference, because His name is holy. By saying, Hallowed be your name, is important at the beginning of the prayer as a sign of respect for Him. Because His name is holy. By saying, Hallowed be your name, is important at the beginning of the prayer as a sign of respect for Him. In prayer, we enter the audience chamber of the Most High and we should come before Him with holy awe. Children, this kind of attitude is very important. This is the end of our morning worship. May the Lord bless and protect all of the children on this wonderful day. Amen. <music> 